What's up everyone, Destin Laguerre here with some tips to help you easily complete the Fleesa Heist and Grand Theft Auto Online. The heists in Grand Theft Auto Online are one of the best parts and the most fun I've ever had with Grand Theft Auto. You're gonna need a rank 12 character and you'll need to own the high-end $200,000 apartment to host the event, but if a friend already has all of that, you can join them to take part. By default, heists offer huge payouts, but there's a few ways to get a large pay bump. No matter what, the first heist completion is gonna net you a cool extra $100,000. If you complete all five heists in order, you'll receive an extra million dollars, and if you keep the same group, that's another million that'll be added to your bank account. However, the big challenge is the Criminal Mastermind Challenge that requires you to complete all the missions with the same group on hard without anyone dying. Criminal Mastermind Challenge will net you a cool $10 million bonus if you're successful. That big payout is what we're gonna try to help you get. Today, we're looking at the Fleece job. First, the setup missions. This tutorial heist requires two players and an $11,500 setup fee. The first setup mission scope out is pretty easy. One player drives Lester to the bank while the other completes the hacking minigame. By the way, the person that does the hacking minigame should also play the part of the driller in the next mission. More on that later. Once you've arrived at the bank and hacked the system, Lester will have you drive a Granger with all your gear back to your apartment. The next setup mission, Karuma, has you picking up a car from gang territory. Once you arrive, go into the south entrance for the best cover. Drive to the top of the ramp and kill everyone. Once they're dead, just drive away with the vehicle toward Lester's factory and avoid any gang members chasing you by taking out their tires. Now, you're ready for the actual heist. There are some elite challenges that can give you a bigger payday, so keep them in mind as you begin. The elite challenges are to beat the mission in under five minutes, 20 seconds, make sure that the vehicle doesn't take more than 6% damage, and to make sure that no one dies. The driver and hacker need to bring their A game to meet all of those requirements. Driver, try not to crash into too much stuff and hacker, here are the paths we took to complete each of those hacking challenges. Now, the actual mission. Driller, you're gonna need to hold R2 about halfway down and press the left thumbstick lightly towards the drill case. If the drill starts smoking, let off the left stick immediately. Once you've drilled all the way through, a cutscene will play and you're done. Driver, you need to take out all the cameras in the bank and then shoot near the hostages to keep them off of the alarm. Once the driller finishes, shoot any cops outside of the bank and then get in the car. Start driving towards the getaway point, passing the roadblocks on the right when you're able to. If there's no space, don't feel too bad about smashing right through the roadblock. After three roadblocks, drive under the cargo bob to complete the heist. Remember, these are my best tips for this heist. Have any helpful hints for the community? Let us know about them in the comments and for more advanced tips or strategies for the other heists, check out our GTA Online Heist Wiki. Until next time, I'm Destin Laguerre, and I'll catch you guys online.